Well, what an outstanding 4th of July day. I know it's kind of hot for some folks, but boy, this is the kind of weather you want, right? You family, pools, beach, barbecues, and now fireworks are going to be taking place as we go through the evening hours. And other than one lone shower out there, most of us will stay dry. The late afternoon temperature is 90 degrees. No wind to get us uh, any kind of relief. So hopefully you've been in and out of somewhere that's got air conditioning. Certainly hydrating. A lot of water. Ice water is good. You see the storms and showers that a uh, couple of rumbles of thunder for the most part are downpours there. They're coming in on a lake breeze. The cooler air works inland this time of uh, year with this type of weather situation. So slightly cooler air hitting the warmer stuff. This is going to be falling apart well before we get to sunset. But a few communities may see a brief shower here as we get into the evening hours. There's not many of them and they fall apart at sunset. Out to the west is the change. That's the front going to get here late tomorrow and into Thursday for our best bet for rain. The hour by hour shows a few of these showers but after 9 o'clock they just fall apart as the sun is down. Lows tonight only around 70 degrees and we're going to start tomorrow off very very warm back in the low 90s. So after an evening shower looks like we're going to be dry. Low 80s when they're setting up to watch the fireworks and as you head home after the fireworks will still be in the upper 70s. There is a change coming though with the front that's going to come in from the west. That'll get here Thursday morning so we got one more warm day tomorrow. Hour by hour shows nothing tonight. Temperatures about 69 to 70. Tomorrow, hazy sunshine will quickly be in the 80s, touching the low 90s. Then we start dotting the area with a couple of showers, maybe a rumble to thunder by evening. Temperatures will fall back into the 80s. We'll kind of go quiet for the late evening and overnight, and then towards morning, here comes the front. Showers and storms. Uh, numerous times on Thursday, early and then again in the afternoon, there'll be another go round of showers and storms. All of this will take most of the day to push off to the east, so the temperature is only going to be around 80 degrees. And we'll get into the sunshine and pleasant weather on Friday with sunshine at 82, and same thing on Saturday. Next chance the shower shows up later on Sunday. The five day rainfall total is not much. It shows that Wednesday's got a chance, and Thursday, Wednesday night, Thursday is our time frame to pick up about a quarter. Maybe somebody gets a half inch. Friday's plus so is Saturday. Some scattered showers later on Sunday, maybe even a rumble of thunder. Scattered showers and storms Monday that carries into Tuesday. Look what happens after tomorrow's 92. We're back in the 80s for highs near the normal of 83 and a much more comfortable overnight low.